The biggest design change for the Mark II is that I've moved to a belt drive for the probe. The belt moves the probe forwards until it makes contact with something, it breaks the photo interrupter and then it reverses. Once the carriage is reversed fully, the probe is pushed forward and reset. The stepper motor has a lot of advantages over the servo it's replacing in this design. Unlike the servo, I do need to establish a home position for the belt. When the carriage is fully retracted, the bolt on the carriage closes the switch on the frame. I'm very pleased with this belt design, but I have had to make a much more rigid frame to maintain belt tension.